India, a nation with a history spanning millennia, has always understood the importance of a strong defense. From ancient times, when mighty empires built formidable fortresses, to the modern era, the need for a robust defense has been a constant. Surrounded by complex geopolitical realities, India faces various security challenges. These challenges are not just limited to its immediate neighbors, but extend to regional and global dynamics that influence its security landscape. These challenges range from traditional border disputes to the rising dangers of terrorism and asymmetric warfare. The evolving nature of these threats requires a multifaceted approach to defense and security. In this volatile environment, India has recognized the need for a robust and credible military force. This force must be versatile, well-equipped, and ready to respond to any threat, whether conventional or unconventional. This force must be capable of safeguarding its vast borders, protecting its maritime interests, and deterring any potential adversaries. The Indian Navy, Air Force, and Army work in unison to ensure the nation's security on all fronts. A critical element of this defense posture is the nuclear deterrent capability. This capability serves as a powerful deterrent against any potential nuclear threats. India's nuclear doctrine is firmly rooted in the principle of no first use, advocating for peace and stability. This principle underscores India's commitment to responsible nuclear stewardship. However, this doctrine necessitates a credible second strike capability. This means that even if India were to be attacked first, it would retain the ability to respond with overwhelming force. This ensures that India can respond effectively to any nuclear threat, guaranteeing peace through the promise of unacceptable retaliation. The assurance of a second strike capability is a cornerstone of India's strategic defense. This is where the K-15 Sagarika, India's first indigenously developed submarine-launched ballistic missile, plays a vital role. It enhances India's strategic deterrence by providing a reliable and secure second strike option. The K-15 Sagarika, named after the mythical conch of Lord Vishnu, adds a new dimension to India's strategic depth. Its development marks a significant milestone in India's defense capabilities. Operating silently from the depths of the ocean, it forms a crucial component of India's nuclear triad. This triad ensures that India has a diversified and resilient nuclear deterrent. This triad, consisting of land-based missiles, aircraft-delivered bombs, and submarine-launched missiles, ensures that India can retaliate effectively in any scenario. Each leg of the triad complements the others, providing a robust and flexible deterrent. The K-15 Sagarika is not just a weapon. It's a symbol of India's technological prowess and its unwavering commitment to its security. It represents the cutting-edge advancements made by India's defense sector. It embodies the nation's determination to stand firm in the face of any threat and safeguard its sovereignty and territorial integrity. The presence of such advanced systems reinforces India's strategic autonomy. The K-15 is a testament to the dedication of India's scientists, engineers and armed forces who work tirelessly to protect the nation and its people. Their relentless efforts ensure that India remains secure and prepared for any eventuality. The K-15 Sagarika is a nuclear-capable submarine-launched ballistic missile, a true marvel of modern military engineering. It represents a significant leap forward in India's naval capabilities and strategic deterrence, bolstering the nation's defense posture. Developed by the Defense Research and Development Organization, or DRDO, the K-15 is tailored for deployment on India's nuclear-powered submarines, ensuring a robust second strike capability. This gives India the capability to launch a retaliatory nuclear strike, even if its land-based assets are neutralized, thus maintaining a credible deterrent. Let's delve into the specific features that make the K-15 a formidable weapon system, a true guardian of India's sovereignty. Submarine-launched ballistic missile with a range of 750 kilometers, it can strike deep into enemy territory. The missile is equipped with a nuclear warhead with an estimated yield of one ton, capable of causing significant destruction. It features a two-stage solid propellant rocket motor, ensuring reliability and efficiency. 
diameter 1 meter, weighing approximately 10 tons. The K-15 is designed for deployment on Arihant class and future nuclear-powered submarines, enhancing their strike capabilities. It uses an inertial navigation system with possible satellite guidance, ensuring precision targeting. The missile's accuracy is estimated to be within a few hundred meters, making it a precise weapon. Hypersonic, capable of reaching speeds exceeding Mach 7, it can outpace most defensive measures. These specifications highlight the K-15's compact yet powerful nature, a perfect blend of form and function. This makes it suitable for deployment from the confines of a submarine's launch tubes, ensuring stealth and surprise. The solid propellant motor ensures rapid deployment and reduced launch preparation time compared to liquid-fueled counterparts, a critical advantage in combat scenarios. The missile's range, while not intercontinental, is sufficient to target major adversary installations within the region, ensuring a credible deterrent posture and safeguarding national